What is up y'all? It's King Ranger 13. Today what we got going on is a couple miscellaneous things that I've been meaning to get to. But first thing this morning is that Colby and Josh, my two buddies, they bought a flip house and this morning is the first morning that they're really starting to do some work on. Uh, yesterday they went in mode and little things like that, but today is the real first day of getting to do any work inside and things like that. And so they're gonna be demoing a couple of things. I figured I'd go shoot a video for them just to have something for their Instagram and something to kick off their awesome flip house project. I'm gonna go buy Central Park and get me a tea from Jeremy and Christie's tea shop and then I'll make my way over there. I, I went and got the guys some waters and stuff for the day. And I know they're super excited, and so they're not gonna probably wanna stop to get a drink and things like that. So figured I'd shoot over there and kinda shoot a video for them. Anyways, hey, if y'all aren't already, please hit that like and subscribe and leave me a comment down below. Let me know what should I do next to one of my trucks. I've got the 2015. F-150 King Ranch and then I've got my 2017 F-250 King Ranch. Both of them are probably going up for sale here soon, but I'm just kind of bored with them. Y'all give me some ideas. Actually, I did get something for the F-250 King Ranch that I'll be showing y'all here pretty soon. storm oh. it's demo oh, day oh boy demo day. <laughs> is this is what nolan did <laughs> yeah <laughs> i love it he started early come on <laughs> being over at their flip house and now i gotta go and retune another guy's truck a 2019 f350 took it to a shop and they kind of gave him some not some great tuning i guess and so i'm going over there retune that guy's truck and then the guy at a local shop here has a 2008 6.4 power stroke that's in some sort of anti-theft mode or something like that bank repo and so i'm gonna go and see if i can help them out with that and then i got delivery for a ranch hand rear bumper for a guy local to me so gonna go drop that off to him here a little bit later maybe about an hour or so anyways hey if y'all need any parts or whatever y'all know who to call outdoor trucks our info is down in the details and things like that i'm gonna get going on these little chores and things and uh, I'll get back with y'all. Well, got an emergency call to see if I can get this truck going. And I think it took me about five minutes or so to figure it out. I don't know how I ended up with these things, but anyway, got it out of the anti step system, got it fired up. What's up, Tanner? What's up, Mace? What's up? going, Justin? How are you? you? Ready to get her done? Oh, yeah. yeah, you see my porch here? We did it last night until about when it started just pouring down rain. Looks like you run busy. Yeah. Alrighty, just said Justin drop off his truck with me. I'm just gonna get this thing turned around here in the driveway. And then we'll probably be getting to it tomorrow. Get the truck around here so that customer can get his ranch hand bumper. Mm -hmm. He's pulling up there. There he is.
I know. I don't know what happened. Just totally spaced out. You want to grab that other one? Really not that heavy. Yeah, that ain't bad. Was that you getting on earlier? No, I'm a little up to it. No. I heard a power stroke getting on it up the road right there. No, when you pulled up and I was I thought that was you. Here, hold up. Cummins. Well, I guess taking them tomorrow, but we're doing a couple of things on the computer while I can while it's raining. We also, have a little bit of time this evening, so I'm gonna put on that ranch hand that I did a little trading deal with with the guy Harris, whose truck you just saw. So here we go. <laughs> because I gotta trim it out and stuff like that and I don't have my saw to be able to cut it today. Anyways, that's how she looks. Well y'all, that's it for today's video. Hope y'all enjoyed a couple clips of what I had going on today. Let me know in the comments down below what you think about the brush guard on the truck. Clean or not clean? Let me know. See you guys.